Morning everybody, AmpRepairGuy.com, 203-892-4119. So today we're working on a Ameritron AL80B. So first thing I noticed has the pink resistors. I'm going to lift up one side of each resistor. I already made sure all the caps are shorted. Sometimes you know, you'll end up with an open resistor and then that cap may not discharge and you can end up with a dangerous situation even if you go from the chassis to the anode to discharge them you always want to go across each cap with an insulated screwdriver so I'll lift one leg up check all of them make sure they're all good then I'm going to pull them all out if they are and put brand new resistors in customer wants this grid overload board removed I clean the contacts on the relay over here and the soft start relay over here needs new SO239 connectors. There's like no grip whatsoever. So I'll change those. I'll pull the tube out, high pot it, clean the contacts on the band switch and the input rotary switch. I'm going to remove the metal oxide variistors. I'm going to add gas discharge tubes at the base of the socket between the filament and ground in case the tube were ever to flash between the plate and the filament. I'm going to get rid of these wire ties for the meter lamps and heat shrink and a uh, solder and heat shrink them and uh, check everything else over. Oh, I also have to fix the line cord. He said that it was like this when he got it so I'll have to unsolder all that and fix that. So I leave no stone unturned. So really nice guy, guy uh, from New Hampshire, ham from New Hampshire. So I will be back. See you soon. Stay tuned. Okay, so I replaced all of the resistors. Has some bad caps. So I'm going to have to replace the caps. Okay, so I'm back with the completed AL80B. This thing needed a lot of work. The new resistors, new capacitors. Change the resistor for the 12 volt line, accessory line. Change the fuse holders, brand new fuse holders. Brand new stock line cord. I was able to reuse the factory strain relief. Brand new Teflon SO239 connectors. Brand new strap for the parasitic assembly. Clean the input rotary switch, output rotary switch. Soldered and heat shrunk the meter lights. Got rid of that grid board. And uh, that's about it. Oh, also added gas discharge tubes to the base of the tube socket. One side per filament, uh, for, for each side of the filament. Got rid of the MOVs over here. Tested it on all bands. And uh, this thing is good to go. Also cleaned the relay contacts over here with deoxic gold. So if you need an amplifier repaired, please feel free to give me a call. Phone number is 203-892-4119. It's 203-892-4119. Please like, share, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. 73.